Hello Disney friends, it's Mia and Mickey. Today we're at Epcot. Actually, it's not today, it's this evening we're at Epcot. And you know what? There's a nice cool breeze. It must be in the 70s. So the weather is so nice. It might rain again because it's been raining all day. Because let me tell you, for the, uh, for the past few days, it's been in the 90s and super muggy. So I'm glad we're out this evening. We weren't sure we were going to go out this evening. But it's nice now, even though it may rain and we don't have our rain gear with us, we still are going to enjoy the evening. So why don't you enjoy it with us? Yes, come along with us. Ricky and I are making our way into World Showcase. We want to see who's playing here this evening. I believe it was supposed to be a flock of seagulls, but it is Tony Orlando playing here this evening. We're not sure of the times, but let's go and find out. Because you know what? I'm okay with seeing Tony Orlando. I really wanted to see a flock of seagulls, but that's okay. Tony Orlando is very entertaining. It's 1970s, I believe. I was a child then, and I enjoyed his music very much. So I am a little excited about seeing Tony Orlando this evening. The entrance area of Epcot was not um, very busy at all. Looks like a lot of people were leaving. But here at World Showcase, as always, it's pretty busy. Not too busy though. So it looks like it's starting to rain again. Hopefully it won't rain very hard because we did not bring our rain gear. So we may get rained on. You know what? I don't really care about getting rained on. Neither does Ricky. What we care about is the lightning. That is not good. But other than that, we're okay with getting wet. The camera's not though, so. Whoa,
good. Tony Orlando was awesome. Um, of course, we got in a little bit late. He already had started. But we got some good footage. And now, we're just gonna roam around Epcot. It is raining. And there is thunder. I didn't see any lightning. As long as we don't see any lightning, we're all good. Oh, no, there's lightning. <laughs> anyway, uh, I don't know. I don't know if the show's on this evening or not. If it starts to rain too much, I think Ricky and I are gonna call it an evening and we're gonna come back. But for now, we're just gonna roam around. Since it's raining, Ricky and I decided to come in the Italy Pavilion store. We're here to see what they have in the store since really, we never stop in here much. We kind of just browse and walk right through. So let's check it out together. Okay, so these handbags say Vera Bell, made in Italy, and they're $59.99. These are beautiful little bags. They're in a blush, in a, I'm going to say it's like a taupey beige, or no, more like a mm, coffee color, coffee and milk. And then here is a black, royal blue, forest green. This is like a golden yellow, fuchsia and white. They are so cute. Let's take a look at them on the inside. Let's open this one. It's a very small bag, crossbody, but it's really cute. It, um, it has a, even a little compartment there and a outside zip compartment. This is made super well. Let's see, is this leather? I don't think it is, not for this price. No, it doesn't feel like leather. It feels more like pleather. But they're very cute bags. One more look. And then here are some scarves. They have pretty, a pretty large selection of scarves. Aqua de Parma. Here are the fragrances. You know, I said they were pleather, but now I'm thinking I may be wrong. Because these here are another style and model. And now it's looking to me like it's it is leather. It's like a pep this one's a pebbled le a leather and the other one was a smooth leather. But they're really cute. Really cute bags. So they have white in this color. This kind of uh, coffee taupey tone, camely tone. And then they have this um, royal blue. They have an aqua blue. Or is this gray? The lighting in here is a little off. It's aqua blue. And they have a grass green. Camel. This is a true camel. And a pumpkin shade. So this is very pretty. It's a little peacock notebook. Ricky, how much is the peacock notebook? $12.99. $12.99. A notepad, not notebook. Um, I even correct myself on it. All right, here's another one. This is a floral. Very pretty. And here is a beautiful stationery set. I love it. It's gorgeous. Here is some glassware. It's really interesting. They, they're leaves, but they're different colors. Topolina, and there you have mini, mini in a hat. And this is really cute. This little scarf that you can put on the back of your ponytail. I like that. Let's see how much. Oh, I can't even get up there. Um, Ricky, can you get the uh, scarf for mom? Can you take it off there and get it for mom? See how much that is. All right, thank you. Ricky. How much is the scarf? $9.99. $9.99. But it's really pretty. Oops. And 
there we have some little tiny espresso cups, Mickey, and a small plate and for your snacks, and that's Minnie, and you have the Italian pavilion behind her. And this mini blouse, t-shirt, blouse, is $36.99. And here is another blouse, <laughs> Visit Italy. And there's Minnie in a car. And Minnie, Ricky, how much is Minnie? $39.99. $39.99. Okay, let's take you right over here. And here's a cute little pillow, Topolino and Topolina. And it has you have Mickey and Minnie and Italy in the background. Let's see what we have on the back. Would I Italian Okay, this is really cute. It has Mickey and Minnie and it says Ciao Bella. And Topolino, Arrivederci, Tutto Benny. La Vita Bella. There's Minnie and Mickey. Okay, so we found this skirt here for $78. This is a nice little skirt. Italian pavilion ears or Italy ears. I think this is super cute. I love these. And these are $29.99. They are beautiful. They say Ciao, Bella. Here's a beautiful piece of artwork by Larry Dotson. He's always here at Disney. He's one of their preferred artists. And here is a pin. And it, there's Mickey and Minnie. And it says Epcot World Showcase Italia. Now this little bracelet is adorable. They have another color too. They're cute. Look at the earrings. Right here is a super adorable ornament. I love this. I think I'm going to get one of these for myself. Not today, but it's really adorable. I like it a lot. And then this is a keychain or you can these charms you can put on your bag. It is pouring outside, you guys. Pouring. Here's a polo for a little boy. And it says Topolino, and it has Mickey, and it has Pluto. Here's a t-shirt, and it says Tutto Bene. And there's Mickey. Okay, here are some of the masks. These masks. Oh, wonderful. I always wanted to go to one of those balls that you just can wear a mask like this. I think Disney should have a ball, a princess ball. But then I think Disney should do princess everything, so. But a princess ball, yeah, I think it would be great. Maybe a Bridgerton type ball. I know, it's not their movie, but still, do a variation. It would be fun with those masks. I would love it. This is pretty cool. This is paint your own mask. Wow. They even have a dog one. Here are some masks that you can possibly put on your tree. <laughs> I, I would put this on my tree. Look how beautiful this mask is. Here are some other masks. Those are larger. Look how gorgeous, look how gorgeous these masks are. I'm telling you, I see one that I have to have. Look at this one. Look at this one, you guys. Oh my, how much is this? $99. It is beautiful. 
So tell us about the masks. This is made by 10 different generations making the same line. Oh they speak Greek mythology and astrological symbols into all their work. This is silver leafing with Suwaski crystal on top. Rooster feathers are all custom painted. Oh my god, they are beautiful. And the mask with the stick is? This one here is running at 510. 510. And this one here is 315. They're definitely worth it. They're gorgeous. Beautiful. Thank you. You're welcome. Anytime. Oh wow. They were saying the artist that made this, these masks right here, she passed away last night. So now, oh my goodness, what's here is here. And when they're gone, they're gone. And these are... They range from about 30 to 45. Yeah, this one here is 45. Beautiful. So we have these tiny masks right here. They are so pretty, the detail on them. And here you have earrings. Let me see if I can focus better with the camera. Okay, so these are earrings. And the earrings are $25. Well, of course they're small. And then we have little boxes, trinket boxes. So did you know, because I didn't know, that the Edison has these masquerade balls. The Edison at Disney Springs, they have these masquerade balls. So if you're interested, there you go. I think I'm going to find out more about the masquerade ball at the Edison and fill you guys in. Okay, you guys, this is the condition of World Showcase. Oh, lightning, rain, torrential downpour. I don't know whether it'll keep walking and get wet and call it a night or wait till this stops. But I have a feeling it's not going to stop so quickly. Okay, you guys, I think we're going to walk through this rain. Next time you see us, we will be soaked. Okay? Let's head on out of here. Let's go to the front of Epcot. Let's go check out and see if there's anything interesting. Let's go see if we can go on a ride. Maybe. Because I don't think we're going to be able to see Harmonious. There's no fireworks, so we're not going to be able to see Harmonious. And we're pretty much done seeing Tony Orlando, so yeah. You ready to get wet? You're gonna get wet. Let's go. Okay, you guys, we got as far as Germany. And we are soaked. Yeah. We gotta keep going. But we thought we'd stop in here and just update you guys how we're doing. We're not doing so good. We're wet. <laughs> Okay, look at this. Here's a German pretzel crossbody bag for, Ricky, how much is this? How much is the bag? $44.99. $44.99. Ricky, what do you have there? What is that? Mamba? Is that what you're gonna get? Yeah, Mamba? All right, let's get it. We picked up some caramels and some candy, some Mamba candy. And we thought we're out of here again and then we're just going to continue to get wet and go to our next destination. We made a pit stop in Norway. We're going to pick up the sample of the male and female fragrance. We, I'm telling you, it's totally sold. Ricky wants to show you how wet this kid is. Are you having a good time, Ricky? He is. <laughs> okay, you guys, look at the water. Look at this. Look at this. Splash, Ricky. Jump, Ricky. Jump, jump, jump. Splash. Woo! Oh, Lord. <laughs> it's like a swimming pool out here. All right, you guys, got to shut off the camera. This camera really cannot get wet. I know we didn't get much footage tonight, but it was an adventure nevertheless, right, guys? Anyway, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really do. And 
and um, we are coming back here next week for another adventure here at Epcot. Hopefully it'll be a dry one. Ricky and I will see you real soon. Bye everybody. Have a wonderful weekend and stay dry. Bye.